More and more people are reporting invasive species. In fact, there was a more than 100% increase in reports made last year. And our Ariel Argel spoke with the Department of Land and Natural Resources and the Oahu Invasive Species Committee to find out why. Behind me is a graph of invasive species reports made in the last 10 years. As you can see, in 2023, there has been a significant rise in reports for invasive species. In the last year, over 1,800 reports were made, while in previous years, there has always been less than 900. In the past year, we have seen a number of coconut rhinoceros beetles around Oahu and now on some of the neighbor islands as well. We saw coconut rhinoceros beetles spread from Oahu to Kauai first in the summertime. And then just recently, we had the new detections over on Hawaii Island and on Maui. Um, so if you look down at the data and look at the reports by species, I mean, we've had a thousand uh, CRB reports. The Oahu Invasive Species Committee says in addition to CRBs, many new invasive species were also reported in the last year. Some of the new invasive species that had popped up was the Queensland longhorn beetle, which showed up on Hawaii Island. The other insect that is um, Pretty recent is the two-line spittlebug, and that has been destroying a lot of pasture and grazing lands on Hawaii Island. Although we are only two days into the year, there's already been a report made for 2024. As commerce and travel has increased, uh, that's just more opportunities for pests to move around. And some of these pests are really teeny tiny and small, and they can easily stow away on, on shipping containers, planes, animals, people. Um, so it can be really challenging to make sure we're, we're looking in all the nooks and crannies. Arnott says if you see any unusual looking species that you may never have seen before, take a photo and report it. You can call 643-PEST or go to 643-PEST.org to make a report. Ariel Argel, Island News.